What's up guys? We are at the Prefontaine Classic today. We're gonna film the Saturday's race. There should be a should be a crazy mile. Uh, I think Jakob Ingebrigtsen's in it, Jared Nagus, and a bunch of other great runners. And we're just gonna film the day. Should be really fun and uh, I hope you guys enjoy. So let's get started. All right guys, real quick before we get into the video, I just wanna let you know we're in week two of the giveaway. The winner will be announced one week from today. And to enter, all you gotta do is like this video, be subscribed to the channel, and drop a comment down below or in the video from last week, it's all the same, uh, about what you want and why you want it, and uh, a winner is gonna be chosen at random. Super simple, super easy, should be really fun, and uh, hopefully we can get some really cool gear to you guys. Word of warning as well, I saw in the comments of the video last week that someone is posing as me, telling people that they won. I'm sure it's some kind of scam. If you see a user with like a long username using my profile picture that says you won a prize and he's commenting on a bunch of other comments, just know that's a scam. Sorry about that, I blocked the guy from the channel, but if any others pop up, uh, just make sure it's me. Uh, I'll definitely reach out, get in contact with you. I'll get in contact with you. I'll never ask for any form of payment information or anything like that, so be wary if you run into someone doing that because I don't want you guys to get scammed. All right, let's get into the video. You know it's a good track me when they got a British commentator. Number one rule of track and field. I know, I practice it. <laughs> They're 224 right on the home stretch. It should be sick. Right there. This is 61. Chase Ely leading the way with that beat record. World leading mark and personal best. And Rojas in the women's triple jump up for a third round. Still looking for a good mark. Yo, she's gonna beat him. She's gonna beat him. Sun's in the perfect spot. We're able to work on the uh, half tight tan, stay out of the sun with the head, clean up the half tight tan. She'll be looking great. Summer's almost over, though. Let it out of time. Every single time you came away with the top spot this time, tell me how this season's been for you. Lane number five from the USA, the new world champion, Shaquille. This one's gonna be crazy. There's a great start. Richardson's got a bit of work to do. On the inside line, Thompson Hera. Tarika Jackson in lane number six for Jamaica. Oh. And our next highlighted athlete wearing hip paint is the reigning US champion. Fifth World Championships in Budapest, winner of both the London and the Zurich Diamond League events this year from the US, Yorin Nigus. Our final athlete today, wearing in 13, twice the World Championship 5,000 meter champion, the Tokyo Olympic champion at 1,500 meters, the pre classic record holder in the Bowerman Mile, representing Norway, Jakob Ingebrigtsen. The Goose, Hawker, Ingerbritson. Zawinski slated to take. And away we go. You see Sawinski on the outside in the headband. He will be our first <laughs> rabbit. The Goose to the early lead. McSween on down on the inside.
55 second first lap. That's insane. Is eyeing an American record currently held by Alan Webb at 346.91. There's so many people in the stands too, it's awesome. This track and field is so alive today. Say hi to the vlog. What's up? This is the new vlog squad, I guess. We are all at the store last week. now? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, what's up? Wait, wait, we all on YouTube now? All right, what do you think about the mile? That was crazy. Super slow. They brought a torch there, right? Yeah. Yeah. You are a torch there? They're lucky we were right here. Yeah. If they put one barrier there, everybody's <laughs> we both we long ran this morning, so our brains are shot. <laughs> All that watching racing is pretty tiring, so we're going to get snow cones now to recover. It's pretty essential uh, post watching post watching nutrition. Should be really good. Well, we'll review it after. All right, I am back now. If you couldn't tell, I filmed the uh, week two of the giveaway earlier here, but I just want to let you guys know. One, the snow cone was absolutely amazing. Was it $8 worth of amazing? That's a more complicated question, but it definitely hit the spot after being out in the sun all day. This meet was incredible, and it was just a great weekend of track and field. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what it was like to be in the stadium, for those of you who watched it on TV, or just enjoyed getting a look at the meet, yeah, for those of you who weren't aware of it. As always, it's been super fun posting every week, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. So. Till then, I'll see you guys next Sunday.